Hey guys, I am back with another video, and happy Friday. So yes, two days ago, we got an update for Mortal Kombat 1, and yes, Peacemaker finally uh, debuted, and yes, we finally get to see his face, which y'all know where I'm going to go with this. John Cena's face is in the game. I'm excited to see it. But, yeah, once you perform um, one of uh, Johnny Cage's fatality, like the one uh, that's kind of like the thing you see in Hollywood, where it's supposed to say, like, the character's name, like, Scorpion, Omni Man, or Liu Kang. It does not say John Cena, but it just says Peacemaker. And we got, like, pretty cool references to, um, the show, like, the TV show, like, when it made its streaming services debut two years ago, uh, a few WWE Easter eggs, um, a few references about Batman, Aquaman, Superman, well, mostly one reference to Superman, so, yeah. And, uh, well, we got a few Easter eggs that we might go down. This one, he got a pretty cool helmet that's actually inspired by Judge Dredd. And another one, which I think is pretty funny and cool at the same time, is the football helmet. Which I really don't get why they put a football helmet in the game for his gear. A cardboard mask or a cardboard helmet. Which I think is pretty uh, genius for them to do. And this one is kind of cute and funny and weird at the same time. <laughs> He got a cat helmet, which is like one of those Halloween masks you get from a Halloween store for like 12 bucks, which I think is really weird. But here's another thing. Did you guys know in the game, he kind of got a Invincible inspired tire, just like Omni Man from the Omni Man DLC. You don't believe me? Once I reach to whatever level that is on, I'll probably probably post it on my Instagram. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys have a safe weekend. And what's my thoughts about the DLC? Way much better than Quant Cheese. That's all I'm going to say. But anyway, guys, have a safe weekend. And I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe.